Welcome in once again to the YGO Fresh Off the Press community, where we analyze the current polls, trends, and forecast of the Yu-Gi-Oh markets. Guys, we're here to feed that addiction, but man, man, my voice is shot. I apologize, but I'm too stubborn to not make a video, man. It's just the discipline, the grind. I mean, but yeah, we're here to feed the endless eternal market watch cardboard addiction, guys. You guys already know, man. Welcome in. The channel continues to grow. We appreciate the grind. You know, I don't even feel well, I'm going to be honest, but we still push through, man. We still push through. Destroy the subscribe button. It really does help out. And uh, the like button as well, man. Thank you so much. We're going to keep it short and sweet, guys, because as you can see, you know, um, yeah, I'm not I'm not feeling well. But here we are, man. When we don't feel well, that's when we do what we got to do, guys. Look at it. Look at it. Shout out to Aaron, my guy. Just open what not to, to get that $15 credit got myself a mud dragon of the swamp qcsr for free just paid three dollars ship you can't make this stuff up guys make sure you swing by link in the description down below pick up any cards you need qcsrs fenrir's anything right here boom one click 15 billy discount if you haven't done so already make sure you do and take advantage of that guys with the snake eye um new support announced diabell star um the black witch has been pumping into oblivion so you know we're gonna definitely discuss this card um but before that another card that's being affected but by, by all the new support that's coming out is bonfire for maze of millennia at pre-sale prices it's still pumping up into oblivion this card was like 50 billies i think it was you know let me see maybe i'm not mistaken but look at this triple digi ultra rare guys don't don't fomo in man this is an ultra rare it's gonna probably be short printed and hard to get but this is a top 10 meta card it hasn't even officially come out and it's already getting cleaned out by mr clean one page only four listings look at that people it's insane man. yo what is going on what is that like bo hundo Shh. yo that, that's insane man the hype is real guys so this is the number one buyout right now everyone needs this card um people expect fire kings um sinful spoils to take over the meta and uh Ooh, man guys then we have obviously that bell star the black witch qcsr used to be 143s we discussed this card last you know around i think here like 150s and look you got one deal here but then 250s and eventually 300s one page only then gone single digit listings right here insane max rarity people are getting ready they're coming in and same for the secret rare look right here this card was what 20s in the teens we told you guys to pick this card up and now this card is essentially pushing 50s you have a couple of listings here 45s but then it's 50 bills three pages only 23 listings guys look at this parabolic advance on the charts hopefully you guys pick this card up type bell start black which this is gonna be you know heavily a part of the meta a lot of snake eye support coming out um people have high expectations and look people buying already at these prices so wow what a chart it's entering price discovery this will be 50 billies before you know it and who knows maybe continue on up so i mean right now it's getting cleaned out um only a couple of pages left so if you want it you're gonna have to pay a premium compared to the previous prices but uh yes yeah, pumping into oblivion guys then we have qcsr wanted secret of sinful spoils this one continues at number three here used to be 130 billies and now it's three hundo a pop a lot of one of then four hundred dollars one page only eight listings single digit listings so the max rarity version of this card you get max rarity is expensive yo this is just like 900 plus 10 almost a rack for just a play set of this imagine adding 200 a pop 250 for diabell star Ooh, man it's crazy some people out there paying a couple of racks to play max rarity a wanted package then we have snake eyes flamberge dragon at number four i think yeah four five six seven eight nine i believe so yes this card pumped up to 13s we trace back down to single digits and now pumping up second leg up status here pushing 18s almost 20s three pages only 26 listings as we can see people coming in the demand is going crazy for this one and this will be 20 billies officially before you know it i wouldn't be surprised now entering all-time high status price discovery if it's 25s sooner rather than later then we have superstar slayer typhoon sky crisis the chart says that this card we're getting sales um officially at 30 billies a pop 
and yeah we've been calling this one guys you know i still have my um my stack here you know we did a giveaway and whatnot and on the channel as well so i'm happy i'm eating good can't wait i i see this being 40 to 50 billies down the line that's when your boy's gonna sell we bought in at 16s um so yeah we just patience wins this game guys no rush 40 listings and uh yeah this card is getting it's pushing up in price i wouldn't be surprised to see 35s in the short term future and number five snake eye ash look at this card wow insane <clears throat> excuse me guys look at that card was two and some change 250s Ooh, a super rare from age of overlord pushing 850s almost nine this they could be this could be a, a double digi super rare three pages 26 listings going parabolic all-time high entering price discovery i wouldn't be surprised to wake up one day very very soon and see the super rare at above 10 billies just insanity this card was a quarter a quarter what is that from a quarter that's 4x and then 10x from there I'll, I'll i'll let you guys do the math insanity guys then we have guru wings of resonant life this is six seven eight nine i think so man i'm i'm already lost at the numbers guys the whole point is guru look at this going parabolic as well a little bit of a retracement i wouldn't be surprised to wake up one day and see this card at 15s you do have walls of china here at around 11s but still 32 listings get your gurus now who knows when this card is going to get reprinted um, again, this is not official financial advice. It's for entertainment purposes only. But at the same time, I would be picking up this prismatic secret right now. You don't want to continue to pay a premium. I mean, we told you guys to pick this up here at around five, six, sevens. But still, right now, I'm at 11s. It might be good before it reaches 15s and beyond. Then we have Castiotheosis um, here. Used to be sevens last time we discussed it. Now it's doubled up in price. Towards 15, 16s, a lot of one ofs. The walls are at 19 billies pushing 20s three pages only 24 listings yeah i mean unicorn back to three some people are playing that the cash tira engine with other decks and uh there's still a single print from photon hypernova we were picking these up at four billies so hopefully you guys listen and uh yeah this card is pushing 20s it's insane and we have dino wrestler panker tops from battles of legend heroes revenge max rarity um yeah the ban list came, spiked it up to almost tens, retraced back down now, spiking up above into the double digi range, second leg up. Yeah, you can see here, essentially 11s, quickly pushes to 15s, two pages only, 19 listings, an amazing going second card, side deck card, and uh, I really like this one, man. Well, not max rare, it is min max, this has a CR, I think so, from where? I think from Ancient Guardians, is it? Let me see, man, come on now. Man, you know, I click view all versions and it doesn't show me the CR, man. TCG player need to fix this, man. But yeah, Ancient Guardians now giving value. This thing has pumped up to 150s. Oh, man. Uh, yeah, Secret Rares. I have two of these, I think. I don't know, man. Should we sell these and just buy Ultras? Because this thing is going parabolic, man. New all-time high heading into price discovery as well. Lastly, we have Amphibious, Swarm Ship, and Blow Whale. A lot of people need this card. The demand is crazy. People are getting ready. Um, and um, yeah, for the future format. And look at that. Look at this card was free. This card was free. Spiked up. And now it, it continues the uptrend into a new all-time high. Um, yeah, we see if we click the first editions right here. Where are they? Oh, it says limited. Okay, so yeah. I mean it says 225s, the 20 wall right here. But then it pushes 250s. I wouldn't be surprised if I wake up and this card is at you know threes and who knows maybe even fives down the line guys because the card is not as easy to get from dark neo storm and then the the sneak peek is the ultra rare max rarity so i would be keeping this one in mind the chart higher highs and higher lows this is an uptrend here and it looks like it's going to continue its parabolic advance into its second leg up status um yeah and into price discovery so you need this card unless it gets a reprint um you know let's see look, cards like these should should have been amazing millennia I, I don't get it guys but you know that's a conversation for another day guys man man if you made it this far out into the video you guys are the straight mvps again i apologize um i'm heavily under the weather but we're still here i understand maybe that affects the views or you know maybe um this or that it is what it is you know i'm just trying my best to continue to stay consistent and if you appreciate that make sure that you like um this video and you destroy that subscribe button 
as it really does help out don't forget to check all our other links here a lot of resources the friends of the channel our own podcasts and things of that nature guys thank you so much for your time for your support and for your attention stay fresh <laughs>